To start logging errors into Elma I.O., the first thing you will need to do is to create a new log. A log is basically a container for storing errors. Logs are created from the dashboard by clicking the Create Log button. I'll create a new log named Website Demo. Using the toggles, you can set up which emails to subscribe to. Finally, select a color if you'd like and click the Save button. Once the log is created, you'll be redirected to the log settings screen. Here's where you'll see the documentation on how to install Elma I.O. in your project. Using the drop-down in the upper left corner, you can select a web or logging framework of your choice. Now head over to Visual Studio. For the demo, we are using an ASP.NET MVC project, but most other web frameworks are supported as well. To configure your application, install the Elma I.O. NuGet package. There are packages available for most frameworks. Check out the documentation site for details on how to install Elma I.O. in each framework. During the installation, you will see this dialog accepting your API key and the ID of the log to store errors in. Copy and paste these keys from the settings view. And that's it! Everything is installed, and your web application now logs all uncaught errors to Alma IO.